This is my unboxing for the Love With Food February 2019 Deluxe Box. And uh, Love With Food was bought out by Snack Nation a few months ago. And the, but the prices are still the same. The Deluxe is $19.95 a month and you get about 8 to 12 snacks. They also have a gluten-free box which is the same size as this and a smaller tasting box um, which is um, I believe $12.99 a month. Right now they do have a special deal. You can get your first box free. You just pay $4.99 shipping. You get the tasting box which is like I said the smaller version um, than this one. But you can try it free and I will have those details down below. So I subscribed to this box and let's see what we got. The theme is Open Love. First up from Pop Corners we have Kettle Corn Chips. These taste like kettle, it tastes like kettle corn popcorn only in chip form. It's really good. Then we have Drizilius Cinnamon Swirl Mini Rice Cakes with White Chocolatey Drizzle. I've had like the chocolate version of these and they are phenomenal. So I'm sure these will be the same. We have two bags. Uh, these are cauliflower pretzels. Cauliflower is kind of making its way through the trends right now. So everything's kind of cauliflower based. Um, I like pretzels. These would be good, I bet, with some hummus. I love hummus, so I like to find new things to dip in it. Good source of vitamins, made with plant-based um, ingredients, and non-GMO. From Jana Banana, this is with coconut. Um, this is the original one. It basically tastes like um, a, like if you make a banana into a bar. This is what it tastes like with a slight coconut flavor. You really don't taste the coconut that much, in my opinion. Um, it, it tastes a lot like banana. And then, oh, these are good. From Appleways, this is the blueberry pomegranate. I've had the strawberry and apple versions. Um, and it's almost like a pastry. It has like this, the icing drizzled on it. So, but this one's going to be blueberry and pomegranate. These are great for breakfast. Then we have Live Smart Flax Bar. All natural energy in chocolate, gluten-free, soy-free, lactose-free, no refined sugar, trans fat-free, low sodium, 198 calories. This one is not really calling to me. I mean, just a flax bar just doesn't sound that tasty. Maybe it will be. Um... But I'll save this for a snack when I'm hungry. Here's the next bar. We have the best bar ever. Peanut butter crunch. Good source of protein. Real ingredients. No artificial uh, sweeteners. Alright. I'm going to give this to my husband to take to work. It's where most of our peanut products go. And then we have blueberry coconut tone it up plant based protein bar. This one is going in my babysitting box as where all the coconut products go. Um, because no one in my family really eats coconut. Aside from that Jana Banana Bar, which I, my son will eat that one. But um, as far as anything else, nobody eats coconut in my house. We have ZZ's Honey Roasted Sunflower Kernels. Hmm, nut free. That sounds good. Honey Roasted. Soup and waffle. These are great. You put this over your hot tea or coffee and it gets all warm and ooey gooey. Very tasty. Um, my husband and my oldest son usually get these because eats them because they, uh, my son likes hot tea and so does my husband and he drinks coffee. My husband does. So, very tasty now. We have um, a little sample of wild butter. Now my oldest is allergic to peanuts but he hates even peanut imitation products. He just truly hates the taste of peanuts um, and peanut butter. And he always has. So it's actually worked out because he has no desire to ever eat a peanut product because not only could it, you know, make him sick and potentially kill him, but he also hates the taste. So that's been a little bit convenient. Um, but yeah, he will not eat even an imitation peanut product. But this is nice to have because that way I can eat it around him and I know that it's going to be safe for him um, and it won't risk, you know, his safety. And from Sheffa, we have a coconut dark chocolate granola bar. Again, kind of sad. Here's another coconut product. But, um, so again, my dad's going to love this. He loves dark chocolate. He loves coconut. So I have a little babysitting box. Every time my parents come and babysit, um, they have all kinds of new yummy treats that they love in there. We have an awake chocolate. These are really good. I haven't had this version. It's a chocolate caramel bite and it has like so much caffeine in here. 
Um, a half a cup of coffee in one of these. But they're really good. I love them. Then we have Sour Cherry Double Chocolate Crunch. Ooh, this sounds good. Stevia sweetened, no sugar added. Lily's Sour Cherry. So, cherry and chocolate together. Sounds good. That's everything in my box. So, we have the pretzels, popcorners, cinnamon snacks. We have a lot of bars. Quite a few here. Um, some coconut products. It's alright. Um, I feel like it was very heavy on the bars. I'm not a big bar eater. Y'all know this. Um, I wish there was more chips, more salty snacks in here. I think everything was, I mean, except for the pretzels. I feel like there was a lot of, like, sweet things. Like, everything else was really sweet. Um, I'm primarily a salty girl. Love salt. So, um... You know, while I do like sweet things, I wish there was a little bit more salty treats in here um, for my own preferences. So, but if you want to try this box out, again, you can get the tasting box, which is um, the smaller box, and you can try it free. Just pay $4.99 shipping. That's going to be linked down below, so you can try this box out for yourself. So, check it out down below. I'll have a relevant review of this box. You can also check out my uh, free box list. Give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel and ring that little bell to be notified when I do new unboxings. Thanks for watching and have a great day.